there is one major difference between electric and magnetic fields, which is this. There are no magnetic monopoles. What is a monopole, you may be wondering? Well, remember how we talked about the electric point charge? A charged location in space that has all outward pointing or all inward pointing field vectors? That's an example of an electric monopole. Electricity has two possible kinds of monopole. Positive charge, which acts as a field source and has outward pointing field vectors, and negative charge, which acts as a field sink and has inward pointing field vectors. Magnetism has no corollary for this. You can't have just a magnetic north pole or just a magnetic south pole. Every magnet, no matter how small, has both a north pole and a south pole. This means that magnetic fields always point in circles, going from magnetic north poles to magnetic south poles and back again. This forms a similar external field pattern to an electric dipole, where we have a positive charge and a negative charge close together. But if you look carefully at the near field of the electric dipole, you can still see that the field lines are all pointing from the positive charge to the negative charge. None are pointing back the other way. By contrast, if we look carefully at the field lines inside a magnetic dipole, we see that the field lines form closed loops. The field goes up through the magnet and down around the outside of the magnet. There is no point that has only outward pointing or only inward pointing field vectors. In this sense, you can think of magnetic fields kind of like electric currents. They always form circuits. Current can't flow exclusively out of a point or into a point. It's always passing through, comes in and it goes out. Magnetic fields are like that too.